guys, it's Great Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting to Rain to episode 9 of Spy Family. So let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, hold on, in 3, 2, 1, go. Gotta do this. <laughs> They're so gonna guilt trip us. Come on now, it's obvious. Okay, because I was sick yesterday and I'm feeling better today, I had to literally avoid this episode and scenes from this episode like the plague because I didn't want to get spoiled. So I was like, every single time when I saw something of it and it was like a minute or two minutes long, I'd be like, nope. <laughs> because I don't want to know. So we're going to be smart and we're going to watch this in Kaguya so I can get that out. And then I got to do dance and love live. Try to get those out. And then try to get two more things out after those. So I have like, what, six videos I got to make it today before tomorrow. I don't want to go to work. <laughs> when the money is good, but you don't want to go to work because it's like, ah. Oh. Good job. And you telling me that I didn't wake up Anya? Oh, never mind. Yeah, baby. <laughs> Go back to sleep.
You know, you should really go to the hospital. Yeah, you two are very, very similar. Because <laughs> you were asleep, baby.
No, and I don't think he knows about her job either. I mean, she, yeah, well, yeah, because she came home with blood as a kid, and <laughs> ah, the censored version of this show, I can't. <laughs> Have a good day. But yeah, she's very smart though, and she knows. <laughs> oh my! <laughs> <sighs> Once again, he is proving that he is one of those. I had already known that, but still. <laughs> Well, you know, mm, okay, let's talk about her other character that she plays, 86, is in that film. Take a cooking class! <laughs> I'm about to hear coat workers like, ugh.
あRight, a little too much into this. Right. but he's already had feelings for her and Anya.
to Bobby. show is too much. I can't. <laughs> I can't. It's too much. Oh, that is so cute. Like, uh, oh my god. Like, okay, one thing I gotta say, there is no, like, and I've heard this before, there is no wrong way, right way, no even book on how to be the perfect wife, the perfect husband, the perfect father, the perfect mother, whoever, you know, there are going to be days and today was their day, unfortunately. And I mean, it, it just, it felt bad because like when Anya was reading their minds and you're like, yeah, you two aren't getting along and, and it feels bad because you know, the kid, the kid can sense everything. Come on now. Kids are smart. You know, when we know something's wrong and you just, something's off. And then you're sad about it. And the next thing you know, someone says, like, are you okay? And then you're, you're... <sighs> talking is good. <laughs> in a nutshell, talking is good. Oh, God. But yeah, he has really no reason to suspect you're now. I mean, honestly. Oh, dang, he okay? <laughs> I mean, poor kid. <laughs> Uh, poor child. <laughs> I mean, you know what? Let, let's just talk about that now. Yes, getting hit with a, a, a kickball, dodgeball, heck even, because this has happened to me. I, I accidentally, no, someone accidentally threw a... <laughs> A basketball at me. This is like middle school. Uh, middle school, maybe. No, this is like elementary going on to middle school. And I was at basketball practice. And I'm guessing she was trying to like pass it to someone else. And I was dribbling a different ball and like still getting ready to like shoot and stuff. Next thing you know, like here's my head, here's the ball, smacks me in the face on the side. And I thought I saw stars, like, oh my god. But yeah, getting hit by a kickball or a dodgeball, like, that's the worst. Getting hit by, like, any type of ball that is around the size of your head is, like, the worst thing. Because that, that's immediate pain. I cannot imagine if it was a tennis ball, a baseball, um, a golf ball. <laughs> or even, um, oh my god, uh, da -da 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 -da, what are they called? I've literally, I haven't played this sport before. But I've seen people play it. Racquetballs and stuff. Any type of ball. <laughs> because they hurt. There's so much pain. But oh, oh my god. Okay. 
One, like, am I surprised about the kiss that we got <laughs> jump baited again? No. No, because it was obvious. And we all knew it was going to happen. So, I, um, you know. <laughs> it's going to happen. I guess it's going to happen for real. They're going to have to do it for real. Like, I mean, seriously. The, and it might happen in, like, the second half. Because we're almost done with the first half of this show. We're going to go a whole season without this show. How... How am I gonna survive? Well, then I'm guess I want to rewatch all this <laughs> show during the summertime. I mean, yeah, we got some good things coming out in the summer, but it's like, uh, I just want more, and I kind of wish that we could just have the whole thing. Like, this is kind of how I felt when we were like in the first half of Fire Force, and then when the second half came, and everybody was like, "Oh, this is good," and then you know, slowly everybody stopped watching it, but now everybody's ready for season three. And such, and especially how that show ended, or really that manga ended and stuff. But yeah, I thought it was a really cute, adorable, wholesome episode. I mean, I love the fact that, you know, you're even confined into her co-workers, even though her co-workers are just, you know, big bitches and they can't fucking stand them. Um, but still talking, and I kind of wish that eventually your kind of gets better girlfriends that she can talk to about this, because co-workers i mean especially those three and the one with the hoop earrings who i don't like who wanted to sabotage or no no she need new friends no we need new friends not them mm -hmm. no co-worker friends we need new friends so go, go find you some new girlfriends or mm -hmm, mm -hmm. we need a whole episode on your finding potential new girlfriends to hang out with go out drinking with don't get too too drunk because i mean yeah we've seen you are drunk already twice now it's <laughs> but it's funny <laughs> but yeah other than that guys that is my reaction review towards episode nine of spy family if you guys enjoyed it please give me a like it really helps me out also subscribe to my channel i make videos every single day join the master squad and of course i will see you guys officially on saturday Hopefully, I got to work in the morning shift on Saturday. But yes, I will see you guys officially all next Saturday for episode 9. Bye, guys.